Microsoft OneNote lets you link notes to existing Word documents as well. So in order to do that, I'm going to go into my View tab right here. And here you can see something called Talk to Desktop. So I can go over here into Microsoft Word and you can see that I have a file open and I have this saved in my on my desktop. Uh, note that the link note does not work with uh, files which are not saved because it does not know what it can link to. So I'm going to go into OneNote now and I'm going to link the OneNote to the Word document right here. So in order to do that, I'm going to go into view and I'm going to click dot to desktop right here. And once you do that, you can see that the link note, the, uh, pay, the Word document which was open is actually uh, on the side and here is my note window. So in order to link it, I can go into uh, my review tab and over here you can see that there's link notes. So let me just click on this and it'll give me uh, the pages which I have in the Microsoft OneNote. So I'm simply going to go over here, navigate onto the area. This is my link note. I can actually go over here as well and I'm going to select my untitled page right here. This is where I'm going to link the document. So I'm going to press OK and here uh, that page has been opened and I can type in anything. So this is, uh, let's say for example, this is a linked note to MS Word. All right, there you go. And once that is done, I can actually simply close this out and I can expand this out as well. And you can see that now this file is actually linked to the doc one. So if I were to click this, I can simply press OK. It opens up the Word document which it linked with. So mind that the Word document has to be there in uh, the exact same place where you saved it last time. Otherwise, this may not work. So now you can just uh, close that out and the link note is there. In the Word with link note options, you can go over here and you can also delete the link on the page if you want to delete it out. If you delete it, then the link is removed and it is no longer linked. So uh, you can also go over here. Uh, let me just open up Microsoft Word again. Uh, with the same file and I'm going to go over here uh, open up the link no all right in the re review link note select the link note and I'm going to create one right here let me just expand this out all right right there you go all right so now this is the link note and you can see that there's the link note options and once I go to the drop down you can see that there are link note options right here so let me just click on that and over here you can see that uh, you can remove the links from the link, link, link node. You can also allow the creation of link node. If you were to disable this, then it won't work. So if your link node is not working, you may try turning this on as well. You can also save document snippet and paste thumbnails for better linking. I would like to turn this on because it helps me uh, link the files better. So I, I can simply press OK. However, if you want to disable it, you can simply disable these. So that is how you can create link notes using docking windows inside of Microsoft OneNote. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.